Here's some tips for finding a buyer's agent who's worth that commission. After nearly a decade of selling real estate, I've noticed something. Most people just hire the first agent they meet and often end up regretting it. First things first, don't settle for just any agent. You want someone who's a full-time pro with market expertise. Of course, you're gonna Google them, but you need to do some deeper digging and check out their reviews on sites like Rate My Agent, Real Satisfied, Yelp, and Zillow. And while you're on Zillow, take a peek at their recent sales to see if they're really selling anything. Once you've got a short list of potential agents, put them to the test with a quick phone call. If they don't pick up or get back to you soon, immediately no. And if they launch into a sales pitch before even hearing what you have to say, just move on. Let's talk credentials. Do they have an alphabet soup of certifications or designations after their name? Are they on any boards or committees? You probably wanna hire someone who stays up to date and is always learning to be better. Time for the face-to-face -face meeting. Did they arrive on time? Can they answer all of your questions? And I wouldn't hire an agent who can't explain the contract with ease. Here's the kicker though. Do you like them? Are they confident yet friendly? Can you imagine yourself cracking open a cold one with them at a barbecue? Trust your instincts. Now a word of caution. I know it's tempting to hire your cousin's wife's brother-in-law who's dabbled in real estate, but be warned, buying a house can turn even the calmest person into a raging ball of stress. Do you really want to be the topic of conversation at Thanksgiving dinner after they've messed up and made you look like a bridezilla? Trust me, it's better to keep business separate from family. Plus, your agent may know more about your finances than the IRS. Do you really want Uncle Bob knowing how much money you put down on that house? Spare yourself the awkwardness and hire a pro. You can always negotiate a referral fee for the friend or relative so they don't feel overlooked. Great tips for hiring the best agent to help you buy a home. Now go forth and conquer that real estate market like a boss. Or you could skip to the good part, hire me, and spend your time doing what you really want to do, scrolling on TikTok.